What up boys and welcome back to yet another season of Discovery Gold Farming video. In today's uh, video we have a gold spot that's really good. It's better if you have skinning but you don't need to have skinning to specifically farm this. So before we dive into the information, big thank you for all the support on the complete gold guide for Season of Discovery. It's been absolutely amazing and it makes me happy that you guys are enjoying the gold guide. Now I also updated the gold guide with phase 2 investments so if you don't have it already make sure to check it out with the link down below in the description. So this location right here is by killing wargans and there's a lot of wargans like for instance I did a one hour uh, test on my live stream just killing and skinning wargans. It was a different area but I just wanted to get the feeling of uh, like how much leather you could possibly get doing it per hour and it turned out to be roughly seven gold an hour not including like any green or blue drops from the mobs. Now if we head over to um, like this location right here is where I did skinning but if we head over to this location just outside this cave right here it gets really interesting. The mobs that we're going to be killing are these Nightbane Vile Fangs. As you can see there's a bunch of them. They don't hyper spawn however they respawn pretty fast. Now not every class is going to be able to farm this efficiently as the mobs are level 29 through 30. Uh, but if you can farm them efficiently you can make a lot of gold doing so as they give a lot of heavy leather because they're high level, but that's not the most uh, important thing. They can drop these Mad Wolf Bracers with 5 agility plus 2 stam. They're really, really valuable. Depending on your realm, they're roughly 20 gold each. And they don't have a super bad drop chance, like roughly 2%. So uh, for a 20 gold item, 2% drop chance for a mob that you can kill relatively easily on something like... A hunter, big shocker, everyone plays a hunter. It's considered a very decent farm because it's one of those farms where if you have skinning at least, you're going to be looking at a decent amount of just uh, steady gold and then the icing on the cake being the bracers or any other green or blue items that you can get from the farm. So head over to uh, Duskwood right here outside this cave area kill the vile fang mobs and cross your fingers for mad wolf bracers or any other valuable blue uh, or green boes now that was pretty much it for today's video but i got a bunch of sod gold making guides coming so make sure you are subscribed to my youtube channel and you can always feel free to check out the complete gold guide link down below with that being said thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you all back in at tomorrow's video bye bye